Right now, the name of the game is to get paid at the plant and to get gold in the box. If I can't get consistent gold coming across the sluice, I'm never going to hit my 500 ounce goal. Nearly halfway through the season, third year mine boss Fred Lewis is finally up and running. But he sluiced for just one week and has pulled in only six ounces. You know, if I can't pull this season around, my mining career is over. I, I'm not going to be able to continue. We've got some gold in the box, small gold way, but honestly, it's not enough. So we're going to pull that pay from last season that's accessible and get as much fed to the plant as possible. To hit his goal, Fred now needs over 30 ounces a week. He's banking on it coming out of the freedom cut, ground he believes could hold the mother load. Oh, I lost the two. I will choose very not to block here. Now walk the machine over sketchily off this pile and so I can fix it out there. Track. I'm peeing on the tracks now. So now I'm sitting here on this pile. One track, one less tooth. Hell. Now instead of loading a rock truck, I'm gonna have to get this piece of fixed. I'm gonna have to lift this side of the machine up walk that track, try to keep it straight because I'm on top of a pile, drop off on both sides. The only thing that can make this any worse is if the other track broke. We can't win to win, can we? Yep. So you broke, the track broke in, we lost the shank on the Yep. Holy crap, man. Well, I'll get it over there. How long do you think it's going to take? All right, it's not your fault. Well, you're kind of screwed. The 250's down in a big way right now. How long is it going to be out? Uh, honestly, I don't know. Unable to dig out pay to feed the plant, Fred is once again shut down. Everything is stacking up against us here. I know it's gold mining, and you know if it was easy to mine, everybody would. But this is horse. And that 500 ounce gold is slipping away. The Lewis Cruz 250 excavator is down with a busted track and a missing bucket tooth. Without the 250, we aren't pulling pay. If we aren't pulling pay, we ain't running to the plant, we ain't getting gold. Buzz first reattaches the broken tooth before the crew move on to fix the track pin. Having any vehicle down for any given time it slows us down on anything. So having this one down is a pretty big deal. So the broken part of the pin, in order to get it out, we gotta actually cut the darn thing out. And just get it done, get it done as quick, quickly as we can. As soon as I get that darn Bushing melted out of there. When the pin breaks, 
it shears it. I mean, the massive power it takes to do that is crazy. And when it does, it, uh, it up the rail a little bit, definitely. All right, what's your plan now? Is it a twist and walk over this way, and then we'll walk back, kind of line things up? Well, that's, that's one thing you're good at, is walking with no track on, so. <laughs> Does that look straight? Yes. I don't look too bad. There you go. Oh. That's right. There we go. Keep going. I always visualize just going up there and picking it up and putting it on. But it's, it's massively heavy, and that's just not possible. All right, she's ready. All right, let's get back to work, guys. Good job. The 250, finally back in the cut, digging pay. Back in action. Fire it up. Fred is sluicing again. Stuart. Yeah. I've now pulled shrapnel from you twice. <laughs> that is true. <laughs> once from combat and once from gold mining. Yeah, I know, right? Where's my so, purple heart? I know, you should get a, we should have a gold heart. It is dangerous, but what I'm holding in my hand proves it's worth it. We, this is uh, 2,700 yards we ran. To hit his 500 ounce goal, Fred needs over 30 ounces a week. JB, you wanna call this one off? Oh, I get the honors. Yes, right. sir. And one, is two, three, four, five, six, eleven, twelve point six, twelve point six four five. Worth over twenty-one thousand dollars. Double his last haul, but well short of their weekly target. Numbers like this is for hobby miners. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. We're not there yet. The wash plant, I, I would say at this point, is functioning 100% properly. Mm -hmm. Everything's working the way it should. The only way we're going to hit that goal is to keep that plant running. So <laughs> back to work. We're ready to roll. Any business you start the first three years, you're probably not making any money. But it still has to pay the bills to keep it going. So um, I've got to keep positive attitude, keep driving forward, and just let the guys feed off of me. 